Yo guys, I'm back and I'm super pumped up for today's episode because today we are buying the racetrack and the two, the two dune buggies. Yes guys, that's right, that's right. So first I just, just should we fly over there? Okay, and I'm also going to show you one big trick that will save you. Yes. So, if you want to get to your airport any place, like over there in time, then just do this. Go up this little hill with your golf cart or any vehicle. Yes. Simple. You can actually do it. So surprising, isn't it? Now, we got to go to the lighthouse. I just have to purchase two things over there. And then we get to the racetrack. So I'm just going to do a quick swap. And I'm going to use my four wheeler. This is the squad bike. It's super fast. It's so fast, guys. And, okay, yes. Oh, oh my gosh. So it's top speed. It's top speed is 57 that it's top speed guys 57 miles per hour that's a lot oh 61 it reached 61 you start the car it takes over boost to 61 again oh let's go down this lovely and calmly Oh my gosh, I am terrible at driving. Yeah, I, I don't even have a driving license. Yeah. Now let's buy the dirt road. Oh my gosh, that's a lot of dirt. You gotta buy the bleachers. These are the bleachers. Just this guy sitting. The match, bro, the match is not ready yet. Not in the dune buggies are here. No buggies are here. There's this guy. He's just there. You want to see me building? I'm gonna buy out these beaters. Hey! Did you bought popcorn? Okay, let me use There's gonna be a popcorn stand somewhere. Or another bleacher. More? How many people are going to sit here? Some lighting. The archway. And the foundation. So I just started out with a lot of money guys. But before I got all that money. I was participating in the Halloween event. Yes, there's a Halloween event now. Yeah. And in that Halloween event, you can get a pumpkin carriage. Isn't that so awesome? Pumpkin carriage, guys. Good girl. I, I think. Should we go for the supercar too? Mm, no. We'll do that in some other way though. Yeah, should we buy the speed buggy? Or the traction buggy? So the traction buggy just has more friction and it can just, uh, it's like very good in handling and very good in turning and if you're almost about to tip over, it will be able to get up. The speed buggy is just very speedy and if you're about to tip over, if you just move a bit, you just tip over. Yes. Exactly. So first to just get your money source. And I'm gonna buy this popcorn stand here before we go all cray cray on the other stuff. We need a source of money, that's why I'm buying all this. The pretzels and popcorn, I'm gonna get money from them a lot. Look at this, so much money. Pretzel goes in there, we get money. The popcorn goes and we get money. Yes. Now I don't have any vehicle. Okay, looks like I'm just supposed to walk everywhere. Okay. 
Now, we put that button there. Or these two buttons. Let's check out these two buttons. The decorations. That's fine. What goes here? An expand iron from 2 million? Oh my gosh. Okay. So we have to expand our island. And buy the decorations too. Okay, let's see how much do we have. I hope it's like more than 100,000. Okay, what do you guys think the amount is? If your amount is right, then I'll be. What will I do? Yes, I'll send your friend request. And. And give you some money. Yeah, in the game. Okay. Oh, it is more than 100,000. So it was 175k, guys. If you can remember from the start, it was 175k. Yes, and then it turned into 223k. Collected it, and that's how I have 306k right now. I have 353. It increases so much every like every 30 seconds it hits 50,000 so that means in a minute I earn a hundred thousand with this you just gotta wait for 10 minutes and we'll have 1 million yes 10 minutes we'll have 1 million guys this is so cool by the time all of that happens, I want to show you guys my Halloween event castle thing. Yeah, I just, I just reset my character there. And so walking, like driving all the way back. And so walking to the villa, getting a quad bike, then driving here. I can just reset my character. Here it is the portal. So it also said that. If you complete it, you get a permanent in-game award. I still don't know that in-game award. I've completed it. I bought the pumpkin carriage right here. This costs Robux. See, it costs 79 Robux. I think that whole haunted mansion is completed. Just let, me just, let me just guys. Let me just show you guys. I'm gonna go up here. And look. Everything's completed. Do I see any button? Put in the comment section below. And I also want to show you guys something. It's something that's very scary in this house. Yeah. I mean, right now, just look there. This Halloween decorations, coffins, a broken wall, and the sand, and some sand. If you go over here, it's just normal house. But upstairs, first floor over here, and the second floor, it's all normal. But when you look at this, it looks like a catastrophe happened. That's exactly what happened. Look at this, guys. Okay, if you guys are like five year old or four year old, I recommend you not to see this because this will give you nightmares. Yes, just skip the video these claw marks and another claw mark so when I bought this cage I bought it for 50,000 and then there were three question marks written buy three question marks like, literally just one question mark it was like this have me chat buy yes there you go buy For three thousand, for thirty-five thousand. I thought it's gonna give some exotic pets and like some monster, but nope. It just gave these a broken cage, the scary footprints of some type of super monster bear. Then the lid over here with the claw marks, and the gold over in the attic. So this is the attic. And when I climb the attic, there's these candles. Let's see, somebody has to put these in a cold place. 
they're melting. You just go up here. No burdens, right? After this, it took me so long. By the pumpkin carriage. Because it cost 750,000 candy corns. Right now, we have got new currency. These are like candy corns, if you guys don't know. Yes. So here we have the currency. And look at this the event. So these are the event coins. The currency is just the currency. Now just look. I'm stacked up with a lot of money. I don't know what to buy. Just keep on despawning this. There's something up here. Do we have to buy the Robux stuff too? If we do that, I'm gonna get super angry. Seriously, guys, I can show you the proof. Let me show it. Look, permanent in-game price. It is update Halloween event. Enter portal across street from the resort. Build your own spooky island. Permanent in-game price for completing island. That's exactly what I just did. That's exactly what I just did right now. Why is nothing showing? There's this new event that's been there since since it's actually a few days before Halloween. Yes. Like in September. Yes, it was like came on September twenty first. And then I checked this thing out. A few days after Halloween. Yeah. So I'm just gonna like so the trick, I just use this trick all the time now. Yeah, I mean, I'm getting pretty bored of just being over here, then climbing all the way, and then going from the airport to the long path. You guys see that there's a spawn of a plane right there, that body. It looks so small, the rim. So I'm right next to it. It looks like this. So, okay, so I just bought this door part for 500,000. These foundation, okay, just a little bit more than our budget. Yeah, yeah, it's like 43,000 more than our budget. Now you can just buy the base foundation. I hope the base has a cash collector in it, and that would be really good. Because then, if I'm close by to the airport or somewhere next to this, next to the base, like very close to the base, I have to do just drive up to that base. So I exactly, I know exactly where the base is going to be placed. It's going to be in some type of square shape, pentagon, or polygon, or something. Square. Simple, yeah. And none of the grass is going to be touching me. I just see right here. This glass is merely touching me. Barely. Look at this. Such a great distance. Man, this grass is tall. Bro, you're taller than me. Yeah, there's nothing in real life. The grass is literally way shorter than you. A tall grass is like two U stacked up. It's taller than two U's. Yes. Right. Now let's go back to our objective. Our objective is not like about that. It is to buy the racetrack. So we're gonna try and complete the racetrack today. And for sure we're gonna buy both of those buggies. The speed one and the traction one. Both. Now let me just spawn this. Four wheeler. Drive it out of this place. Oh, this is so fast. I can't control it. This is why I like the traction buggy more than the speed buggy. Because the handling is terrible. If I move over here just a bit, it takes me all the way here. It's so bad in handling. If I just go in this way direction, I turn. I go out of track the whole time. Oh, I almost fell. And if I actually fall from here, I just triple over and fall into that. 
Get the wasi. I don't want to fall. If we get too close, I'll fall. Okay, so just gonna back up a bit. Ooh, oh! Oh gosh! Seriously? Oh, this is so slippery. I'm so close. Oh! Ah, I'm so close! Can smell it! Oh yeah! Oh! So close, guys. I can actually smell it! Okay. Smell it drowning. I think I'm gonna drown. No! No, guys, no. But seriously, okay. Sure, this will work. Okay, looks like we have no option but to do this. Yeah, I like the way in which, like, I twist to it. Yeah, I like slid down and then reset my character. A few seconds before I hit the ocean. Now let's respawn our golf cart. I really wish there's some vehicle at the base. Cause if I go here, the next thing, the closest foundation, won't be the villa. The villa is the second closest foundation. Be this base. The third closest foundation is the airport. It's actually very far. Fourth is the racetrack. And the fifth is not the lighthouse. It's a resort. The sixth is the lighthouse cave. I'm both Oh, oh, oh! Man, that was good, you guys. That was good. Just make sure to hit that like and subscribe button for me. Yeah, alright, do it for your boy, boy. Boy, boy's me. Yes. Now let's go down. And if you have one million. In that cash collector, we'll buy the speed buggy. Yeah, for all the people who like speed, the speed buggy is coming. What's this? Buy dog. Seriously? We already have a way bigger dog than what they want us to build. Oh, there. Yes, it's so far. The villa and all these rocks are coming right up. Yeah, and the most farthest place from this place. Is the dog? Yeah, I'm just talking about it now. It's whole being picture. You just got two hundred thousand. It's less. I'm not gonna buy you, dog. I'm never gonna buy you. Not unless I'm like rich and I have like lot of millions, five hundred million. Then I'll buy it. It'll be a piece of cake. Yeah, really, piece of cake. Guys, there, was, there was a time which I played this game and I was super rich. Yes, I had like 13,000. And then I bought the supercar, already had all the buggies. I completed the aquarium, the arcade, I bought everything that was available in that time. Now, not much of a wealth, really. Now I'm just sadly poor. In that time, earning 1 million was very easy. It just take two minutes to own five hundred thousand. Really, two minutes. I mean, four minutes to own one million. Yes, four minutes to own one million. Forty minutes to own ten million. And four hundred minutes to own a hundred million. Four hundred minutes. Let me just simplify it for you guys. It's basically six hours. Yes. Six hours and forty minutes. It's night time already? Man, we should buy some light in this place. You need four hundred thousand. Yeah, that's a lot, guys. That is a lot. Okay, yeah, one million one seventy thousand nine twenty. Okay. Let's just wait here right here. So we like almost just a few seconds. We have to buy the speed buggy. Okay. So how about in the next episode we buy 
and we complete the whole race track and buy the traction buggy then. So in this episode, I'll just, I'm just gonna buy the good old little speedy buggy. And then the next episode, we're gonna complete the whole race track and then drive our speed buggy in it. And in the third episode, finally buy the traction buggy. The next episode after the next episode, buy the traction buggy. After that, finally, supercar. After those, the next to next one. Wait, let's just make that simple. Let me explain it again. So, in the next episode, we will be buying the arcade and the aquarium. We're actually supposed to buy that first instead of buying this. Yes. So, we'll buy the arcade and aquarium in the next episode. And then the other episode, after the next episode, we'll complete this whole race island and buy the traction buggy. And the episode after that, we buy the supercar. And the episode after that, I don't know what else is left to buy. Wait, there's a fire and rescue. Yes, we'll buy the fire and rescue. Yes. Oh, guys, we're so close to buying speed buggy. Once we buy the speed buggy, this video will end. So we need this so less. Oh, boom. Let's buy the speed buggy, guys. And we're just gonna test it out. So with the speed buggy, we're gonna drive all the way back. To where it all started, resort. Yes, this is our speed buggy, guys. Woohoo! Oh, it goes more than 75 miles per hour? You gotta be kidding me! This thing is supreme! Ooh! Let's drive it swiftly and properly! Guys, uh, this is what I don't like. This is exactly what I don't like. And we gotta swim all the way there. I, I don't even think you can climb that much. Okay, guys, now just make sure to like, to subscribe, to subscribe, and to share. Oh, yeah. Now, see you next time in the next episode of Roblox Tropical Resort Tycoon. Bye. See you later for the last time.